Good evening, everyone. This is Elvira. I hope everybody had a blessed holiday weekend. I know I did. It was a long weekend, but I'm glad it's over. Back to reality. Tonight, we are going to do chicken and rice. And I've got clove of garlic, two onion, four carrots, a bag of broccoli and cauliflower, and two mushrooms. Also, two pieces of chicken. And what we're going to do is we're going to use a roaster pan. And it's really unique how this all comes together, but it works. And I worked out twice today, so that's why I look like, and I even work today, so it's like I feel like I ran through, been run through a mill. So, we're going to just take our cauliflower, put it in the pan. Because everything's gonna come together. And at the very end, it's unique how this all works. And yes, we'll have a calorie count. I did mostly, I still had a lot of leftovers from last week, so I took those up to my lake house. And then we had storms on Sunday, and I just slept on my couch all afternoon in the trailer because I couldn't do anything. But I've been looking at houses up in that area because it'd be much easier and I could take my boys, which are four babies. Love them to death. And uh, my fur babies are always get stuck at home and I don't always like that. Cause then I had to make a special trip back. But it was all good. I ended up getting some work done that I needed to. And that's always a good thing. I will be eating this all week, but it's really yummy. It's unique how this how this all works out, but it does work, and it's just neat. And one ingredient is the key, and um, it's the whole key. But you know, the idea is eating healthy is very important. And counting calories in your carbs. I do count carbs now a little more than I did before. And today, you'll see that I'm a little dead. I'm just tired. Today was my double day. And uh, I'm learning how to really heavy lift now and squats. And squats kill me. I was dying today. Then I have to lift a 45 pound plate as fast as I can and then slow as I can. And it's like, I was just getting tired. And I was working on stuff and I gotta finish my job that I'm working on tonight. And it was something that I could relax on. Even though we got rained out. Okay. If you don't have a roaster, just use any kind of pan you have. It's just, I use this. Um, I just had it forever.
pretty much, uh, pretty much stayed on my regimen all weekend. Sometimes I cheat and I'll have a piece here and there, but I really, this weekend I didn't. Right now, my main goal is to be at the end of the year to have the rest of my weight off and be 140 pounds and learn how to maintain it again and learn how to live a healthy, normal life. Something I didn't have for six years. I left everything go and stuff, so. And it's unique because there's no really measuring a seasoning. You're just going to coat with chicken. And I use two th chicken thighs because at the end, you're going to debone it. But you're going to cook all the vegetables and everything together. half hour 45 minutes to an hour we went want all the vegetables tender and we want the chicken really brown good because we're going to have the chicken completely done because we're going to debone that chicken People have asked me if I drink. Um, I pretty much drink like a Trulies or Bear Claw. Or they're called White Claws, but I call them Bear Claws. And uh, I don't really drink regular alcohol. I haven't in a long time, and when I was this size before, I never drank because I couldn't hold the liquor. So I don't. Um, but there's a lot of things out there you can drink that don't need, you know, like, they're sort of like in the duels that I drink, but they're nice because it serves the purpose and, you know, it's nice. and get our meat. I got two chicken thighs here. I'm going to wash them first. I always wash my meat, even when I put it away and use it. That. What we're going to do
These are the only four ingredients you use in Hungarian paprika, pepper, poultry seasoning and sage, seasoned salt. Now, what we're going to do here, we're just going to take one thing, I'm just going to coat this really good. You want the seasonings in the pan, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, shake something like this. This is the key ingredient, Hungarian paprika. Okay, we'll do the other one. Just gonna season it real good. I don't really, I'm just gonna coat it. And then we're gonna shake this all in here. This is what it looks like. Can you my hands? And we're going to shake more. Because this is the key ingredient right here. I'm going to mix it up. And I'll show you how we'll make it. I'm going to let this cook. This is what it looks like now. I'm going to let this cook. I'll be back in about 45 minutes to an hour. And I'll show you how to do the rice and everything. Be back. Stay tuned. Don't forget to like, hit the like and subscribe button. Elvira, be back. God bless. Bye.